Okay, guys, so. Okay, so we're gonna take our paint that we used before. Let me just move this in my table. So we're gonna use the paint we used before right here. Okay. We're gonna add a bit more orange. Just a bit, not too much. Just a good dot of it. I'm just gonna mix it up. Now this is comes this color. It's not exactly orange, but a little bit better. So let's take this one here. So you're gonna clean your dotting tool that I use clean. So now you're gonna use your detail brush. You're gonna need water, but I don't have water right now. So you're just gonna dip it in paint. You can get this brush at the dollar store. It comes in a very good package. So now, what you're going to do is just take a round oval. Just to rub the whole nail. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. You kind of want it as a little thick of a line. Not too much, but it's just a little bit. I got this brush at Dollarama, the one behind um, Metro Town. Okay, so I'm gonna take an oval and get clean this brush. And just clean it later. So look like this. Okay, so it'll just be a round oval. So now you're gonna get a white striper. <laughs> You're gonna get a white striper. This one's very thin, but it's, this one is very thick of polish. Sorry. So now you're okay. Gonna hold this. So now we're gonna make like a peace sign on in the oval. Okay, you don't want it to be too thick. Too thick. The you don't want the line to be too thick, but just thick enough. Okay, so, so it will look like this, like a peace sign in the middle of the oval. So, so now you've got to get your dotting tool. If you don't have a dotting tool, a bobby pin works just just as well. Okay. So you're going to get your dotting tool and you're going to use the big side of it. Okay, so you're going to put it on your piece of paper. And just so you're going to take your yellow okay, and put it on a piece of paper.
Now you have to take a green, the green, and just add a teeny wee bit. Not too much, just like a little tiny bit. Okay, so now you're gonna mix it all together. If it's too green, well, you need it to be like a light green, so you're just gonna let that little be a little bit. So you're gonna use your yellow, but you you're gonna squeeze up more yellow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Sorry for that, guys. So you're gonna squeeze up yellow. Use your big side of your dotting tool if you have a big side. You can get the dotting tool at the dollar store. I think it's in the sewing section. Oh, embossing. The six color embossing stuff. So you're gonna take a little bit, a lot. And just start putting random dots inside the lines in the peace sign. Because these are so steep. Or from the passion fruit. Basically, you want to put inside the lines. So, if you put it outside, it wouldn't make any sense. So, and you don't want it to be too small because you're gonna be adding stuff later. Okay. So now you have to let this dry a little bit. But I'm not doing that. So, you're gonna take your small side of your dotting tool. Okay. And you dip it in the light green you had before. The light green. Okay, so now you're just going to make a three dimensional thing. So you're just going to dip it into the corner of each seed. So there's one. Okay, so come on, like, right there. Okay, so you're going to do that. And you're gonna do that for the rest of your um life. <laughs> rest of your seed that you made quite easy. Okay. You don't want too big of a dot and not too small of a dot. Okay, so it's gonna look like this. Okay, so you're gonna dip here in the green again. Okay, just a little bit this time, and you're just gonna start putting it on the piece side, the line where you just put it. So there's your passion fruit. It looks kind of weird, but it is actually a passion fruit. So yeah, be it, be it. See you guys in the next video, which is really quickly, because I'm just going to do it right now. So yeah, see you guys. Bye.